When you're watching your favorite players play on TV, they make it look so easy and natural. It makes you want to go play. Then you figure out how difficult this game actually can be to play. I want to share a technique with you that really is the secret behind that smooth, fluid, and effortless look. Elizabeth here is going to demonstrate for us. Now the key to this thing is that most of us are focused on another person's head when we're talking to them and stuff. Most of the focus with your eyes will be up here. And when you watch them smooth and fluid, you'll see that as they cruise across that baseline in their lateral movement, their head isn't bobbing up and down all the time. Two things are involved with that. Number one, she's using her leg power in a way that doesn't raise her hips up. And to create that really light on your feet look, a real important muscle group for this are the hip flexors that are right here on both sides of her body. She's trying to keep her thighs pulled up a little bit more towards her chest and maintain that angle in the hips the whole way. That'll bring the heels up, make you very light on your feet. And if she does this correctly, you'll see a nice straight line above her head the whole way. Let's take a look. She looks light as a feather out there. Makes this game look easy. I wish it was this easy to play. All right, very good. Once again, we have the AP belt on uh, Elizabeth here so she can get good feedback if she's deviating out of this smooth and fluid technique. She's doing a nice job moving laterally, which means she's aligning towards the direction of the net. It's really important that she's building in recoveries into these finishes to get back as soon as possible. Doing a great job with smooth and fluid here. So again, this is a technique you can learn and develop. It takes a little time and it allows you to really smoothly move into stroke and out without creating a lot of forces that break the swing down. So it's important to get there fast, but you want to be there in a position to be able to execute accurately and consistently. So you can see, smooth, fluid, and effortless has the player about six to nine inches down below standing height. And once again, the key areas, Liz will show us, is to keep these hip flexors tight and drawing those thighs up. Stay tight around the area of the, where your center of gravity is, right around the hips. Head shouldn't bob up and down. Work on it. It'll help you flow in and out of those corners and be more successful at pulling shots off when being forced. Speaking of the corners, you saw how quickly she's in and out of those corners. We're going to show you the technique for that next.